Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Learn at Cloud Analytics. So I have received uh, some of you uh, who have asked me where you can find free data sets in order to allow practice on this Power BI journey. So let it be being a Power BI developer or an aspiration or like who is aspiring to become a data analyst or a data scientist. There are uh, free resources where you can go ahead and get the data sets that is interesting for you to progress with this data analytics journey. So in this video, I'll be looking at uh, the top 10 best resources where you can find the data sets in order to evaluate and make your learning journey comfortable. So without any delay, let's get into this discussion. So among the 10 uh, websites that I've categorized here, there are also apart from these uh, several other uh, places where you can get uh, free data sets on the website. Right. So firstly, we'll look at the workout Wednesday. So I'll quickly go to my browser where I have opened this already. So workout Wednesday is something which is an open challenge that has been released with a data set and the challenge in order to encourage um, developers like us or probably someone who is motivated to make the journey within the analytical uh, career so uh, learning is one part of the way to enhance your skill set but in order to in improve that knowledge i think one should also participate in the relevant uh, open challenges as needed so only when we participate in such challenges it would help us and keep us motivated to uh, continue with that particular learning journey so this workout wednesday is something which has been introduced into uh, uh, initially for the Tableau uh, uh, developer part, but then later they have also integrated with Power BI challenges. So you can make use of the data sets that comes in from both the ways. So either from the Tableau challenges or from the Power BI challenges, you can get the relevant data and you can work on that. But if you wish to participate in a Power BI challenge, you can go to this Power BI challenges which, uh, where they release a data set a fresh data set every week and along with you there would be a lot of other uh, users as well who are on the learning journey so you can just uh, participate and get to know new things that come along the way the second best uh, website where you can get such uh, best uh, data sets is also another one called visvis so this has also been um, uh, conducted by your uh, tableau uh, team or uh, someone who is uh, familiar with the tableau so they release the data sets on a uh, weekly basis that's on every wednesday they conduct this uh, challenge for the tableau uh, uh, community but uh, you can also get the data sets from this particular website and use it for your uh, learning part as well and there is also another uh, a website which is a makeover monday so this has also been organized for tableau community however you can also get this data set and try to work on this particular challenge so uh, first thing is that remember that whichever tool that you're learning in uh, tableau or power bi either of them are both related to bi so i think even if that is confined to tableau specifically you can still go ahead and uh, get the data set and try to work on your own right so the next uh, important website that i've come across is the wish for social good so this is something which is uh, uh, organized or which has been uh, run for a charity purpose and they also release on a time to time basis some uh, data sets and they ask us to provide our own analysis on that given uh, problem or on that particular data set and uh, uh, the selected or uh, the top uh, data sets or the top list that have been chosen that would be hosted on that particular uh, website so i think uh, since this has been done for something uh, for the social charity purpose if you are also been involved or if you are been able to be a part of that good purpose then it's also a good thing to do right so i hope you go and uh, try to be participating in this particular uh, activity as well so then comes the other website which is the tableau uh, website so tableau like i said this is also one of the other bi tool and which is also among the leaders uh, on the gartner's chart so from tableau also we have a uh, lot of uh, da free data sets being provided from the tableau uh, company itself and they have been categorized into different uh, 
the sections so based on the uh, relevance of your requirement or where you are interested to look at you can just go through each one of them and you'll get a lot of data sets within that particular section so see they have given tremendous amount of data sets where you can look ahead and get that particular data and you can uh, throw your analysis on top of that particular data set all right so the, the next uh, website where you can also find this free uh, data set is the data.world. So from this data.world website, you can also find a lot of free uh, data sets that have been published on a, a frequent basis. And there are different topics that have been categorized uh, based on the data set. So you can just uh, go ahead and look for that particular uh, topic where you are interested to evaluate and get that relevant data set for your requirement. Then comes the other data set, which is the uh, open government data set. So there are a lot of open data government uh, data sets which are been uh, open for free of use. So you can just uh, try to download the data and you can try to evaluate that particular raw data as well. So the one that I'm currently showing up is for the Indian government data. And uh, you can discover the data set based on different categories as uh, provided by the government itself. And uh, where you would like to really find or do the analysis, you can just jump into that specific category and get that particular data set. Okay. So then follows the other one, which is the NASA data set. Yes. So if you are someone who is interested to uh, focus on the spatial data, right, where uh, you'd like to focus on both uh, like uh, NASA related data set. So this is a placeholder where you can find such open data set being provided by NASA. So you can come here and find the data that is really uh, uh, interesting for your uh, analysis and uh, perform your uh, uh, needed uh, modeling or probably find the needed descriptive analytics on top of that data set. And then we have this uh, Kaggle data set where uh, it is uh, mostly used by the uh, machine learning as per as per where they can find a lot of data sets being uh, uh, provided. So you will find both kind of a data set on Kaggle, which is the curated data set and also the raw data set. So you can also participate on uh, in different competitions as well that has been uh, uh, available on Kaggle. So I think this would also help you with your learning journey. So these are the 10 uh, top 10 placeholders where you can get to uh, practice on your learning journey. And I hope this video will help you with your uh, uh, Power BI learning. And probably if you would like to move into a data analyst uh, journey, then this is also something that you can look at. So if you do like this video, please do like, share and subscribe and do not forget to hit on the bell icon for notifications. So that's it for today. See you again in the next video. Thank you.